hello friends welcome back to my channel so today's video is about this makeup look it's the first time i do my own makeup so we are learning together guys um uh i'll show you how i achieve this look guys if you are new to my channel this channel is about health and beauty and uh almost everything guys so don't forget to subscribe if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for always supporting this small channel your support means a lot to me guys so yes guys so guys uh, I went to clicks and this was the mascara that I fall in love with. So the last time I used the mascara on my eyes, guys, it was yo know, maybe five years ago, something like that. So yeah. And then I bought also the eyeliner, but then I'm not gonna be using it on this video. Today I wanna use this eyeliner here. I bought it just by the other cosmetics shop whereby they sell a lot of things here. Yeah? And here's the other one also, the glitter eyeliner as well. They have a silver color. Mm -hmm. And um, they have pink. They have green and also they did have blue so So guys, we're gonna go ahead and take this brightening primer. Yeah, I bought it uh, clicks. I I didn't know what to buy. As I reached there, I asked a certain. I just asked any lady who was working there. I asked them what what you could recommend for me. Um, and then she gave me this primer. So she say it could go along with my skin tone so i don't know guys i'm just gonna try it and see how it comes or, or how it goes and uh, i just loved the the feeling of this primer guys it felt so smooth and silky it felt yeah it it felt I don't know it just felt silky so I'm just going ahead and uh, rubbing it you know I'm just rubbing it on my face I'm using my hand guys I don't know if I'm doing right or what but well like I said it's first time I'm doing this makeup so yes guys uh, you're just gonna see the process how i'm doing it i hope along the way as i get used to this makeup thing maybe i'll improve guys you just uh, keep supporting by watching and correcting me where i need to correct and then uh, i'll try to improve but I'm kind of enjoy doing this and I'm really enjoying guys I'm really enjoying so guys this is the foundation that I bought by the cosmetics shop they say it's a matte and uh, well I bought it I went to clicks and then I was asking they, they said they didn't have the the, the, what is this the foundation of my color they say it was finished or something like that so I was lazy to go to the other clicks because I was in hurry the time I was buying the most of the um, the cosmetics and makeup 
I was in hurry because I was, I was also going somewhere with my husband and kids. We were just going out. It was weekend, so yeah. And then I ended up uh, buying this um, by the different shop. Uh, yeah. So this sponge, I bought it at Clicks. I do have a lot of sponge. Um, it's a beauty blender. Yeah, but this one it seems to be you know very soft. I bought it by clicks, and uh, I think it was around 50 rent or 50 something, but it wasn't uh, it wasn't expensive, guys. Yeah, so now I'm trying to blend this foundation, guys. See, before uh, using this beauty blender, I did. Um, use water I just soak it in water and then I squeeze out um, the water and then yes guys I'm just blending I didn't apply much um, uh, what is this I didn't apply much foundation because I love still I don't know I just still love I don't know I love the 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 skin to be still looking natural and i just love that cloth or the shiny part of it of my skin i don't know that's just how i am maybe because i'm not used to, of applying makeup i don't know guys but i just love it this way i didn't apply much as you can see so now i'm gonna go ahead and apply this concealer here the last i bought this concealer guys it was three years ago so i don't know if it's still ex if it's still fine or it's expired honestly i would be lying if I, I don't know guys i just bought it three years ago i remember very well i, I got quite a lot of makeup but some like uh, some i i don't know i just I don't know whether they still ex they're still in good condition or they expired. I don't want to lie because I would try to apply makeup and then the next thing if it doesn't come out right, then I just you know I'll just stop or I just leave. So hey, today guys, I just try to put my fears aside and just try to learn here. Um, slowly trying. Uh, to feel comfortable and I'm willing to learn a lot of things as much as um, willing to share with you guys the little knowledge that I have about certain things I think YouTube should be uh, there whereby women we connect or sisters we connect with each other we feel comfortable around each other we learn together and I, th I think we need to enjoy this process so um, i wouldn't mind being corrected if you want to correct me about something just let me know then i try to improve the next video maybe it, it can even be better so guys i was relying on the natural light because it was uh, raining um since yesterday um so um, i was relying on a natural on a natural light sorry and uh i'm just near my window but i'm making sure that the sun doesn't reach my uh my face because i didn't apply the sunscreen yes guys i was just a distance from the window so i don't know if you were able to see what i'm busy doing here guys so i'm gonna go ahead and use this powder this powder also i bought it it was three years ago and the brushes i got quite a lot of brushes but i see guys um all of all the brushes that i bought I don't have these ones that I don't know normally I see people on YouTube here they use 
uh, to apply the eyeshadows with and all that so i don't know where i can buy that one you can please let me know on the comment uh you can comment down below and let me know where i can get those because i really i really i don't know where to get them i don't wanna lie guys so i ended up making a plan you know okay guys so now i'm busy here using one of the brushes i don't know their names guys i'm just trying to use that powder and then dusting it off a little bit before applying it um on my face yes guys but i don't apply a lot i just apply um any way that i feel like or amount that i feel like i need it and then i go with this brush here it's having two different sides i don't know they say it's a spoolie or what guys <laughs> You must correct me i don't know i'm not sure and then on the other side is having some sort of small brush that i don't understand what you use it for but well now i was just combing my eyebrows and uh, i did sh shave them my husband shaved them for me last night i asked him to shave for me last night with his hair machine so yeah um so now i'm going ahead and using my eye pencil my eyebrow pencil guys yeah um yeah i'm applying following the direction or the shape of my eye um, my eyebrows that's just how i'm applying guys. can you see the the pimples there guys i'm having some sort of small pimples coming there i don't know because normally every new month i do have pimples around my forehead so annoying guys okay so i'm applying i don't apply much guys i don't apply much i just trying to follow the shape of my natural eyebrows and just like that guys so guys i went ahead and um I put that concealer the one that I apply in your own yeah I'm going ahead and just cleaning out um my eyebrows gently and carefully making sure that I don't wipe off all my pencil and then yes guys and then I'm also gonna do on the other side as well just like this guys and then yeah that's it okay and I'm just trying to see where I'm missing and all that yeah guys as you can see I keep just cleaning out where I feel like I need to clean yo guys kids is something else <laughs> oh my gosh I love my kids so much but yo at times they tend to be so much naughty yo guys yo <sighs> So like now I'm I'm going ahead with my beauty plan and just trying to plant where I needed to plant. Then I'm going ahead with this. It's an eyeshadow primer. It's the first time I'm using this, guys. So I don't know if I'm applying too much or what, guys. 
but yeah let's just continue and i'm gonna use my my index finger to just yeah you can see how I'm, how i'm using it guys as i said all my brushes i will see that one that i normally see people using for eyeshadows and all that please let me know where i can get those guys so we are not yet done with the application of this primer guys um now i'm trying to blend using a small brush here yeah, guys and then yeah guys you'll so see how it's gonna come out guys So guys, now I'm going ahead with my beauty blender and just trying to blend where I need to. And then once I'm satisfied, then I go on the other eye, making sure that I do the same. And then I go ahead and now once I'm satisfied, then we're gonna move to the next step guys so guys this is the eyeshadows that we're gonna use today and then i'm not yet sure which colors i'm gonna use but i think um I think I'm gonna start with those darker colors first and then I tap on on my eyes by the corner of my eyes and then just like that guys I, I think I, after getting those brushes for the eye, eyeshadows I think it's gonna be make the process even more easier guys and faster so now i'm going ahead with the other big brush i know it's not meant for eyes guys but i'm just trying to easy the process for myself i i'm just going ahead like this and actually it came out fine guys for some reason it came out fine i was surprising me so I'm just trying to blend everything using my bigger brush. I don't know what to call these brushes, guys. So now I'm trying to see what more colors I'll need, but I just I don't want something that is I don't know. I'm just gonna try to choose colors which won't. Um, I don't know guys I don't know how I can explain but well uh, you're gonna see us yes, going forward to what I'm busy doing guys or which colors I came up with the light looks too uh, too harsh guys here I'm sorry for that okay guys 
so i'm trying to pick the colors which will uh almost look uh i don't know guys yeah now i think you are able to see properly what i'm doing i'm just trying to pick colors which can match and then yeah that's just how i'm doing guys So now guys we're gonna go ahead and use that our eyeliner our glitter eyeliner sorry I'm not gonna apply a lot I'm just gonna apply a little bit all I needed it was those glitters guys Yes, guys, I'm just applying, just applying, and then the next thing, I'm gonna go ahead with that our waterproof black eyeliner. And then I'm gonna try to make uh, apply it in a I don't know, is it a wing shape or what? I don't know, guys. Yeah, but I'm applying it this way. You can see. As for applying eyeliner, guys, it's not first time new, as you all know muslim ladies we always we forever applying <laughs> eyeliner so it's not something new and i like applying it following the shape of my eyes it makes it um easier for me i just apply it in a way that i don't know in a way that i feel comfortable I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna lie I'm not gonna uh, try to copy anyone or do it in a different way because I think the best way is to do it following my eye shape so now I just went ahead and picked the other color it was brownish color but it was a light brown I think just applying slowly there 
on my cheeks. So guys, so the reason why I apply this eyeliner in a way that is more visible because I will be uh, putting the eyelashes, the false eyelashes. So yeah, these are the eyelashes that I'm going to use guys. So even the eyelashes guys, I apply in a way that you know it goes with my eye shape i don't just apply it just following anyone i i feel comfortable applying it following my eye shape guys that's just how i like them i know they are not perfect but i like applying the eyelashes following my eye shape it makes it makes it makes it Oh, it makes me feel more comfortable that way i feel like i did right or i don't know how can i explain but well this is how it came out guys and then the next step is that our mascara that we first saw me picking it in the market like i said i bought it at fix so yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and apply on my natural eyelashes um pushing it towards the false uh lashes so that they blend together yeah guys guys yo i'm making voice over <sighs> laying on the bed I'm so tired guys it's very very late Just, this is the only time my husband and kids are asleep the noise is you know so, so yeah I'm going ahead with the powder yeah guys So guys, now I'm going ahead with the highlighter and just applying a small amount there on my uh, bridge of my nose. And then I'll go ahead with the, the highlighter just a little bit and applying on my cheeks. So guys, <laughs> I don't know if I'm doing it right or not. Yes, guys, I was saying if you you have kids, you see even when I'm shooting, there's my son at the background. Oh my gosh. <laughs> when you have a husband and kids, oh, it's always noisy. But it's cute at times. And then sometimes I always have to scream like a mad woman, especially when the kids they start be more naughty guys yo right now as i said i'm making voice over it's very very late it's close to 12 o'clock it's night guys imagine so now i i did go ahead and uh, um on my other eyeshadow palette it's a palette i don't know yeah i i took the brown color and then this is what i'm applying in my nose guys i don't know if, if there's any difference you can tell but well this is how it looks like guys and then i think we are done Yo guys, this as I have already explained, this is my first time doing this, but I think I love the look. I think I love the look, guys. If the lighting is 
is too is too much guys i'm just gonna try to maybe shoot in a different angle next time but like i said i was relying on a natural light so yes guys so this is our finished look guys thanks so much for watching um don't forget to subscribe like and comment i'll be uploading more videos guys as for the skincare you know the tips how i keep my skin glowing guys and i'll be sharing more tips and um this is the end of the video guys bye and uh good night from my side because um I'll be uploading this at this time of night and I'm gonna join my family now. Bye guys.